Today on Till Vacuum Do Us Part. Welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part. If you're new here, my name is Ashley. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is gonna be a little more casual than most videos. I'm not gonna really add voiceovers. I know a lot of you guys just like face-to-face -face sometimes, so if that's you, this video is for you. If you need cleaning motivation, that is gonna be here as well. So I've gotta get stuff through, done throughout my entire house, but I'm not gonna put like a time limit on it. So this is gonna be more of like just an all day hanging out with me, cleaning, and kind of just seeing a more realistic approach to how I tackle chores in my house. So if you're new here, go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below. And if you check the bell, that will give you notifications anytime I post a new video, which is twice a week. And let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I came in here to get my tripod, but this is one of the areas I really need to work on today, just so you guys can kind of see a sneak peek of what's to come. Okay, I filmed a whole scene for you guys. Proof, right there, there's my tripod. <laughs> but it didn't get me folding laundry, so you guys missed that exciting clip, but I'm sure you guys will all survive. Um, I typically don't fold laundry in the morning, but like I mentioned earlier, or I think I mentioned earlier, I'm so like sleep deprived at this point. Um, my nieces are in town, so we've been like waking up and just like go, 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 go. So today is just all about catch up and getting this house in order. So I need to get caught up on laundry. So today will be more than like one load. I'm folding in the morning, but I thought this would be funny to show you guys. Like, look at the colors Chase and I wear. The only pop of color are the girls' socks, and those are from like a jump house where they're required to wear their socks and I'm just getting them clean so I can save them for next time. But everything else is black and gray. I don't know. I just think that's so funny. Okay, I am so glad to have all the laundry put away because we went to get in the shower this morning and we were out of towels. So that is restocked. Let's not even talk about my dirty mirror. I think if I get in certain areas, you can actually like see how dirty it is, but that's not on the list for today. So we're not gonna do it yet. Okay, the next thing I wanna get done is just like a real quick speed clean of like my countertops, my dinner table, and then maybe just like fluff the cushions in the living room. We've ran in the house a lot to like eat real fast and change clothes and then run out. So I feel like I haven't got to do any of my just like daily chores. Like I said, I guess the best thing to call this video is like a catch up day <laughs> or something like that, just because we've been so busy that normally all this stuff gets done daily and it hasn't been touched in like, three days because my nieces are in town, which I absolutely love. That is the one thing that will keep me from cleaning and even working. If you guys follow me over on Instagram, um, I was trying to keep you guys up to date just a little bit, but it's so hard when my nieces are in town. We just like hit the ground running and we do as much as we can while we have them. So that's what I've been up to. So I know my countertops probably don't look dirty on camera, but trust me, they are. It's been several days since I've even pulled out a product <laughs> and wiped them down. So I have the kitchen picked up for the most part. I probably need to do a few dishes, but I'll worry about that later. But now I'm gonna just come kind of fluff up in here. There's the boys. <laughs> um, one thing I get asked a lot about, and I think I always forget to talk about it in videos, or if I did, people miss it. They always wanna know why I keep this plastic right here. 
and it's because the big white one <laughs> thinks he's little. Tiger likes to sit right here, and if you see, it just kind of smashes it down a little bit, but George likes to lay here, and it will ruin the sofa, so I just put that there, and he won't go near it, so I just picked this up off Amazon, and it was like a clear tablecloth, and I just cut it into strips so I can change this out as needed, um, but he's never really gotten on it, so I don't mind if he's like on the furniture. I just don't like him smashing down the back. But he sees the little one do it, and he doesn't realize how big he is. Does he, Tiger? Yeah, he just doesn't know. <laughs> Now we're gonna go ahead and switch gears. We've been talking about cleaning, but now let's talk about clothes because we all love clothes. So first off, here's my messy closet. <laughs> I have one of my outfits on. If you guys don't have one of these change yet, Chase listed it over on Instagram and they were super affordable. I think you got like a three pack for like $4, but that was like a deal. So I don't know if we still have it. Even if not, it's still a good price. I love to put all the new clothes I get in a separate area. If I immediately put them in, I forget I have them. So I like to put them over here, wear them first, and then once I wash them and put them away, typically I know it's there. I don't know, maybe it's a head game, maybe it's just me, but I always like keep my new stuff separate. And speaking of new stuff right here, I do wanna thank ThreadUp for sponsoring today's video. So if you're new here, I love ThreadUp. I talk about them on camera, I use them off camera. What you guys don't see is I actually have my daughter onto ThreadUp because she is a preteen and at that preteen age, brands really seem to matter. If you have a child that age, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, she's really into Lululemon and Lulus are really expensive. So it's so nice, I can just jump onto the thread up app i can type in her size even the color she's wanting and she can just scroll through and add them to cart and it saves me a ton of money and time because we don't even have one that close to us it's like a town away so it's been very helpful for her and me as well if you guys are first time customers thread up is also giving you guys a really good discount code so if you use vacuum at checkout you're going to get ten dollars off your order plus if you spend $50 or more you're gonna get free shipping so definitely do not forget to use that I'm gonna put that link down below in my description box so like I was mentioning with Savannah they have all the best brands so they have high-end they have low-end I use and wear all of it and love it I typically don't search by brand I love just seeing everything that's in my size and color because it kind of like opens up my world but occasionally there are some brands I love for instance like like the leggings I have on are Zella's. Let me try to get back so you can see. They're what I wear in all my videos. To me, they look and feel like Lulu's, but they're way cheaper. And I have it pulled up right here for you guys. So originally these were $30, so they're already affordable, but I got them 60% off the estimated retail and I got them for $14.99. So to me, that is a huge steal. I love them, I wear them every day. I paired it with this gray top. Um, I wore the same top in tan in my last video and you guys loved it because you guys saw me in another color other than black. But I'm not always just wearing athletic clothes. <laughs> so I went ahead and picked out some dressier clothes for you guys. Off camera, I go to church, I go on date nights, I have other events, so I thought you guys would kind of like to see me a little bit dressed up. I'm still wearing denim, but let me go throw that on real quickly. Okay, so I'm in here changing in my closet, but I wanted to show you not all the items are used. So it is the like largest online consignment thrift store, but they have so many new pieces. Like look, this is brand new with the tag. It's Ann Taylor. So they have the estimated retail as $29.99, but that's actually the sell price. So based off $30, I got it 67% off and I got it for $12.99. But if you look, it was originally $44 and I got it for 13 so not all the pieces are used so if you want to just buy new clothes on there you can do that as well okay so now i'm on to look number two sometimes it's just easier to hold the camera so you guys can see like the full look but what i'm loving 
loving about this one are the jeans. So I have been buying this brand of jeans recently um, from another like higher end boutique. It's definitely not any discounted. And I've been paying anywhere from like 60 to $70 just for a few pairs. I've been trying to like up my jeans game just because I have so many leggings. And then something clicked to get on ThreadUp and search Vervets and they had them. So if you guys haven't tried Vervet jeans, definitely search that on a thread up as well. I'm loving them. I love the quality. They just feel really good on and I feel like they're very slimming. But the estimated retail value of these was $71 and I got them 73% off for $21.99. So jeans that I've been paying almost $70 for, I'm getting for $21. I also picked up another pair they're right there hanging. I got them for $18.99. So if you have those favorite brands, definitely, definitely check them out on ThreadUp because you could be buying the same brands just for way, way, way less. Okay, and then I thought I would just share this blazer real fast. I love having blazers on with camis. I feel like it just dresses a look up. So as you can see, I'm not dressed up. I just have sandals on and denim, but just adding a blazer to a top, even if you get like a graphic tee, you can dress it down but still feel super cute you could even throw it on with wedges if you want to but this top was originally $45 I got it 67% off and I picked it up for $17.99 so if you add up my outfit let me go add it up I want to go say, see how much it is because this is all from thread ups so let me go see how much Okay, just so you guys can see how much outfits are, like what kind of deals you can get, my last outfit with the gray top and leggings was only $26.00. Think about that, $26. You probably are spending more on your leggings or just your shirt than that. So that complete look was $26. This one is $57, which I still feel like is a really good deal because these are super high end. I forget what brand this is. I'm sure I've added it on the screen. Oh, it was Express, wasn't it? I think that's Express. So even having these nice pieces for $57, I could dress this up with heels. I can wear this a million places. I can mix and match it. So once again, if you are a new customer, you're going to get $10 off your order. And if you spend more than 50, you're going to get free shipping. Um, so definitely check them out. I'm going to have the link down below in my description box. And thanks again to ThreadUp for sponsoring today's video. The next thing I'm going to work on are my floors. I know you guys can't probably see it. I'll try to get up close, but there is grass everywhere. So our grass goes dormant. Oh, look at George out there. That's why there's so much grass on my floors is he's Velcro and he's going to come in and it just releases when he walks inside. <laughs> there's Tiger. <laughs> but our grass just is like, it goes dormant. So it just dies and comes in on George and ends up all my floors. Once it starts turning green, I get so excited because it doesn't happen anymore. But I can't even show you like on camera you can't see it but if i'll just like go down <laughs> there's grass everywhere like everywhere i wish i had a camera that would just like show you but there are just like piles of grass and then in corners there's clusters of george like that because i have not touched my floors in a while so that's what i'm gonna work on now Nothing better than clean floors once they've been so bad. You can see right here, like it gets underneath my bar stools. It just goes like straight there and then corners in the hallways. But I wanted to take this out so you guys could see. 
Look how nasty that is. Isn't that insane how dirty our floors get? So I was able to do all the floors except for our master bedroom and Chase's office and then Savannah's hallway and then none of the bathrooms or bedrooms. But just like the whole kitchen, dining, living room, hallways. Oh, and then the entryway. So if you guys missed my last video, this is what we worked on. I love, love, love it. Get a better angle. So we did the accent wall and then we added these lights and we actually didn't hardwire them in. We just did touch lights up in there. So if you wanna see how to do that, so easy, so affordable. So definitely check out that video if you missed it. Okay, so we have Savannah now and we are headed to lunch. It's 12.45, which is actually pretty late for us that to is be late. lunch. Um, but it's a really pretty day because it's actually gonna get cold here again, so it's not too bad, but we're gonna head on to McAllister's. We had lunch, we went to Walmart and picked up a few things. We were out of fruit, but now it's time to wash the car. <laughs> We've had, what, six people in here the last yeah. four days? <laughs> so we're gonna clean the outside and then we're gonna clean the inside. But this cool car wash went into Owasso. Perfect timing with COVID because we're just eating and hanging out in our cars. <laughs> and mine actually stayed very clean thanks to this car wash so it's nice you go through the car wash here i'll show you and then you can go over here and they have all the supplies for you to get the inside clean as well Literally in like 10 minutes, my whole car's clean, isn't it? It's so better. nice. I think it helps because I have Chase and Savannah always helping me. So we all like grab a vacuum, grab a bottle and some cleaning rags. And we just like, we all have our own duties that we do. But it's so nice just to go through there and like fresh start. Because <laughs> you don't realize how dirty your car gets. Especially when there's six people in it for a week. Okay, we're home. It's like every time we leave, that's when stuff gets delivered. I don't know if that's the case for you guys and it probably freaks the dogs out, but apparently this time we had a big order. <laughs> okay, so now it is laundry time. I had Savannah clean out her bag from being at grandma's and this is what it looks like. So let's go ahead and get some laundry going and then I'll go work on that closet once we have this in the washer. the dreaded closet now I cannot make this thing perfect I've tried for so long I'm like oh as soon as this done or as soon as that's done it's gonna look so much better it's not <laughs> as a part of my job I just always have stuff in here I'm always buying decor I always have sponsorships but it can look way better than what it is currently so if you're watching this I've actually already decorated for spring so you guys can go check out my um 
video, but this one's getting filmed first just because it was a sponsorship. So if you want to see how I used all this stuff, <laughs> then go back a video. But I am going to go ahead and tidy this up the best that I can. So believe it or not, <laughs> this space actually looks better than I thought it was going to. Like I said, it's never going to be perfect because it's a work closet. I'm constantly bringing stuff in and out. I did put like a basket here with just extra decor. I've got future stuff going on over there. Extras over here. But all in all, I think it looks way better. I can actually like see the floor. So to me, that is good enough for today. But half the reason it's cleared out is because it's sitting here in my office, but I'm going to be filming my spring decorate tomorrow, which like I said, it's already been posted. So if you missed that video, definitely go check it out if you want to see how I use all of these items. But this is stuff I've been buying and putting away. So I'm going to leave this out just because I'll be filming it tomorrow and I need to get all of this stuff taken care of. If you want to know what's inside these boxes, and you missed that video, <laughs> go see what it was. And then all of this is like donate or get rid of. I will say these two pillows are the softest pillows ever. So I'll probably keep the inserts of those and then donate the rest. But that actually didn't take as long as I thought it was going to. I wish I would have done that like a long time ago because it just looks so much better now. Okay, I'm feeling so much better. The last couple days, it's so fun hanging out with family, but then like, you know, there's just that voice in your head of like, you need to get this done, you need to get that done, and this is getting behind. It just feels so good to have like the kitchen wiped down and clean. The laundry I'm getting caught up on, you guys know that's like all day thing, so that's still gonna keep going all day. But it's nice that Savannah's is in there and her stuff's gonna get clean. I love that my office closet, I have been putting that off for weeks. Like I was gonna put that in all of my like spring cleaning videos and I just could not get motivated to do it. So sometimes you need a day that's like, for closets like that, maybe where you don't have tons of like intense cleaning, I feel like today's just been normal cleaning that I needed to get caught up on so I could tackle a big project like that and it didn't turn out to be as big as I thought. And another thing, just getting my floors clean is huge. I mean, just walking around and not seeing like grass and fur, plus my house smells so much better like when the floors are clean because of the like mopping solution and then the laundry's going so it smells like clean laundry and now my closet's organized. I feel like I'm just like check, check, check. So I probably have some more things I needed to do but I just wanted to like stop, take a break, update with you guys. I really like these casual cleaning videos sometimes just so you can kind of see real life and today really isn't like typical for me. Like I said, I'm not doing my normal routines. I'm just like playing catch up, but we all have catch up days. We all have those weeks that they don't go as planned and so we just need one day to get super caught up and typically it takes all day because we have life in between. So I'm sure I'll be cleaning until tonight, but it's just nice to get it spaced out but knock everything off the list.
Okay, so I still have some laundry to work on, but I'm gonna take you just through a real quick home tour just to show you all the spaces that have gotten clean. I just feel good. The car's clean, the house is clean. I'm still gonna be working on laundry, but that's just the story of my life. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and just show you kind of how the house is looking right now. We'll start off in my closet. Everything's clean and put away. I'll probably actually vacuum in here, but that's about it. Bathroom's clean. I'll show you our laundry. I'll probably run it once I'm done with Savannah's, but it's not even that bad. Typically when I open this up, it's like full, like you can't even see that shelf. So we're doing good there. Our bedroom's clean, the bed's made. That's just a ton of blankets I lay with in the evenings. Here is the laundry room. You can hear the washer running. That's just still Savannah's load. So I'll switch that out here in a little bit. Here is the kitchen and dining room. Everything's clean. Living room's clean. You all watched me do the floors down there in our entryway. And then back here in my office, this room looks a little dirty just because all of this I'll be using to film tomorrow. But then again, the closet got tidied up. So I feel like we did really well, not to mention my car is clean on the inside and out. So I call it a very, very, very productive day. But now I do wanna vacuum my bathroom closet and then this room as well. and in this here I feel like I got everything checked off my list and honestly it's only three o'clock now I do have laundry to catch up on but you guys know that will go into the wee hours of the night and I think you guys have watched me wash fold and put away laundry hundreds of times so you guys know what it looks like um i do want to thank thread up again for sponsoring today's video don't forget to check out their link down below in my description box and if you're a first time customer don't forget to use the code vacuum so you get ten dollars off your first order and if you spend fifty dollars or more you'll get free shipping so thanks again to thread up thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and i will see you in the next one bye